Good morning. Good morning. So with any luck, we have the UK on, we have the Tor uh, Toronto on, perhaps somebody from Vancouver, Atlanta's out there, and uh, Miami. Anybody out there from the UK? Uh, just Beep once for yes, yes, twice for no. <laughs> 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 Maybe our <laughs> Anyway, so uh, we started doing gong ceremonies uh, a little while ago, and you know they're fairly informal most of the time, where we actually just show up with uh, the gong out in the cubes here in uh, San Antonio and find some unsuspecting person to bang it next to and announce what the great thing is. Uh, in the last month, Dev, along with a whole bunch of partners in PE, product management, uh, marketing, the big Kahuna, sales, uh, have delivered a, a, a few uh, a few pretty important things out there. Everyone knows last week that the website went out there for Surfer Beach, and after a long, uh, a long year, one year period to get that content out there, actually felt good mm -hmm. to go out there and surf it and um, pick on the photographs of the people who are. Here in Atlanta, we got it maxed out. Okay, I'll. I don't know if there's anything we can do to. That. Just yell, Richard, just yell. I'm trying. <laughs> yeah. right, so, we so we started. Uh, so we did get the website online, and it was a lot of fun uh, to finally get that up and running. And we're, you know, at some point we'll we'll see what the future holds for for the website and some of the content that's going out there. Uh, a couple other things that we've got we've gotten done. Picker went live a couple weeks ago uh, in Server Beach, which should fix. Uh, start the fixing of, of automation, so there's many things to do, but uh, so Picker actually being able to pick automatically without per, uh, people <coughs> in, intervening would, would, be, uh, would be a great thing, so that's out there and we're testing that and making sure that it's working now, right? So, um, you know, we'll be watching closely as we add more SKUs to that. A couple other things we've got going on, um, Hyperion, we find we, uh, the VIPs uh, out in managed, are now um, are now capable of actually looking at a single pane of glass instead of keeping two Hyperion sessions up or two different monitoring systems up. Uh, so that actually helps us in from just personnel efficiency. Uh, and then finally, the big news um, today, if I'm not mistaken, we're launching hypervisors at the beach. Okay, so that's uh, hypervisor Zen. Uh, Hyper-V Hyper and, and Zen, so Citrix Zen is what's out there. So I mean, it actually went live last week with some testing and production, but today should be the first day you're able to actually sell and get them out there. So it should be very exciting. We've done a lot of testing. And uh, rather than just release the production and say have at it, we actually did do a little testing and production this time. So uh, amazing what a, you know, a little learning gets you. Uh, specific, specifically, want to uh, mention a few people. So on the website side, um, and I apologize if I miss anybody, just shout them out if I miss anybody. Uh, Kevin Schwertfeger, Chris Biles, Hussam Daywood, Charlie Harris, Sheila Hodgkinson, Dax Moreno, Robert Miggins, uh, and uh, the QA team, various members have been testing throughout. I miss anybody, Chris? Uh, Kyle Dickow. Was Kyle Dickow, Rajon. Nate Elkin was helpful in actually getting us to production. That was really important. Thanks. I uh, knew I would miss somebody. <laughs> uh, hypervisors. We have Travis Thompson, Josh Wilson, Jeff Chaos, Greg Negolo in there, John Newman, Octavio Schroeder, Jean Philippe Grangi. I just like saying that name because it you know might makes my French teacher crazy. Uh, John Hamner, who you know, is hopefully watching us from home. Uh, Brian Daffer, Ryan Nguyen, Christian Martinez, Robert Cavaluzzi, Jack Baines, who's probably on a plane to Atlanta or something right now, uh, Ron Bradburn, and Jay Newman, out there in Toronto today, hopefully watching along. On the bigger side, I know I'm going to blow this one, uh, Josh Wilson, Travis Thompson, Jennifer Van Van Gorkum, Chris Camacho, Roy Ortiz, and you know various members of the QA team. Okay, I did not get a complete list. I miss anybody on Picker? Donnie. And Donnie. Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> He's quiet. So, um, and then finally on Hyperion, we have uh, Philip McCannum, uh, Whit Fackler, Kevin Lee, and 
I didn't get a list, so I was just kind of making it up as I go. So if I miss anybody, Phil, please tell me. They can't hear you anyways. Uh, you got Witt and Morgan Burke, right? Witt, Beckler, and Morgan and Burke. And Morgan Burke. I miss Morgan Burke. So um, pretty exciting stuff that we've been doing here. Uh, was hoping that Dax would be here because I really wanted him to actually say a couple things, but probably got stuck in traffic or something. Uh, I haven't checked my voicemail. It could be him on there. So um, uh, right after we do the gong, we got a little bit of entertainment planned for you, just for fun, uh, because we got everybody on uh, WebEx. And uh, so let's see. Roger, hmm. would you do us the honor? Sure. Since, you know, now, by the way, this means you have to sell the first hyperprise. Okay, I'll do my best. <laughs> by 10 a.m. <laughs> Thanks a lot, it's been a lot of fun. We, we're, 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 <laughs> that means it works. We're looking forward to actually uh, delivering some more stuff this month and further months uh, as, as we go forward. A lot of good things uh, going on. Uh, I've been referring to this, we've got a big week here that we've got a bunch of uh, uh, Tim, Ted, and Jad uh, are arriving in town. We're going to talk about some of the next phases of our uh, of what we do in development to actually bring a better user experience, enhance automation, and all that. So we're we're moving on with with those types of things. Without further ado, 